Hey guys, the Cube Dude here, and today I have another fan boxing for all of you. Today I have two packages and then two letters. This first one comes from, I did not blur out the name. This first one comes from Arkansas and Carson. Alright, so this package again comes from Carson. Sorry for that little cut, my mom came in. Now let's just rip this off, rip this up, open, whatever the word is, off camera. Sorry for this video being a little bit late, but, uh, let's see, okay, reading first. But, I was gone on a trip. Oh my god, I remember him actually doing this. I remember I was Skyping with him and he sent me this timer. That is awesome. Okay, read me first. Goldfish. So, let's listen to the instructions. Again, guess what I need? I need a letter opener. One of these days I'll get one, I promise. Okay, so... Let me move this stuff out of the way so that we can read this. Dear Matt, thanks for inspiring me and making me feel like a nub. Included is a timer and an original square one. Broken. Thanks for all you do. Then Carson Lefave, YouTube.com slash Carson Lefave, Classy Turtle. That's a pretty cool drawing. Turtles are actually one of my favorite animals. Before it's monkey, but now turtle's almost up there. So, not a lot of you guys know, but my first uh, stack mat timer that I had, I believe it was the same kind as this one. It got stolen at Worlds. So now I'm stuck with this crappy QJ timer. If anybody wants a QJ timer, I'll sell it to you guys. I'm letting you know if you slap it down too hard, it'll start. It'll just reset. Let me see if I can actually get that to, to happen. So zero. Both lights are on. Okay, I swear, if you hit it hard enough, sometimes it just resets. But if anybody's okay with that, and they want to buy it, let me know, and I'll be more than happy to sell it to you guys. Okay, and here we have the timer. Let's see, it. does it work? Mm, oh, okay, the battery's right there, so I'm not going to put that in right now. Thank you so much. And in here... I guess we got a, an original square one. Not sure if that means NF8 V1, which is the one that everyone loves. Or what? Uh, let's get this open. Okay. This is very hard to get out of here. There you go. Alright, so we did it in the fish pattern. So this is really cool actually. Original square one. I'm not sure what brand it is. I'm not sure what the original brand was. But you said it's broken, so I don't really want to turn it that much. Maybe oh like, oh this piece just comes out. Maybe that's what he meant. Let's see. Alright, so that piece is broken. Well thank you so much, Carson, for sending that. Now let's get on to the first letter that we got. This one is from Matt from Colorado. So let's open this up without a letter opener because you guys already know the drill. I don't have a letter opener. Okay. Let's look at this. Where do I read first? Uh, I guess I'll read here. To the cube dude from A I O L A S cubing. Hi, I don't know who you are, I don't know what you want, if you are looking for a ransom, I can tell you I don't have the money. I don't have money. But what I do have is a very particular set of skills, skills I have acquired over a very long, I don't know what that even says, very long something. Uh, skills that make me a nightmare for people like you. If you let me, I can't read this, if you let me... If you let, oh, oh my god, I can't read. If you let my daughter go now, that'll be the end of it. I will not look for you. I will not pursue you, but if you do, I will find you and I will solve you. P.S. You are a ghost cube now. Flip over. You got the doge lives on. He traced it. All right, sorry, I cannot read your handwriting. Random facts. My name is also Matt. Whoa. Okay, I figured out how to read it. There are 293 ways to make change for a dollar. All polar bears are lefties. An average human 
uh, scalp has 100,000 hairs. There are more types of insects in a typical rainforest tree than there are in the state of Vermont. It is illegal to frown at cows in Saskatchewan or whatever. I forgot. I don't know how to pronounce that. Cuban jokes. Okay. Why did Jesus get a DNF? He died on the cross. Why does the Rue user hate pizza? He prefers M slices. What is with what is Wit Four's? What what is Wit Four's favorite drink? Pop. I don't get that part. I I can't read that. Chuck Norris is. Blah. Chuck Norris says Petrus on two by two. Morgan Freeman is sub twenty on the YJ thirteen by thirteen. What hairstyle does a cube have? A perm. Oh, that's actually a good one. What method does Chuck Norris use? F three L. That's all, folks. Okay. Very hard to read. Mainly because I suck at reading handwriting. But don't worry, if I sent a letter with my handwriting, nobody would be able to read that either. Uh, he's got USA, red, white, and blue. The cubicle logo. Alright, so there's that letter. Thank you very much, Matt, for the kind words. Now, I'll save the package for last. Let me go ahead and move these two things out of the way. Then let's get into this. It was sent to me by Christian from California. We got this kind of envelope, which I think is called like a manila envelope or something. But I'm not going to bother opening it the right way. In here. Whoa, that is actually really cool. Holy crap. Whoa. This is crazy. Okay. Hi, I'm Matt. We're in a Rubik, the, inf the Infernape. We got Shing Shao, the Float Cell, and Brittany, the Alakazam. We heard you like Alakazam, so we, our, we tied our trainer's Alakazam and took her spoon so she wouldn't attack us. Guys, this isn't funny. Let me go. Christian Martin, 328.14. This is really cool. I know this po Pokemon. I know that one. I don't know what a Float Cell is, but that's really cool. Okay, here it looks like we got a packet. Oh my god, this is, this is funny. Okay, this is going to be a good one. Dear Matt, hello. I've never sent in fan mail before. Let me get this to focus in. So, with the picture, I give to you my fan mail virginity. Haha. Ha. I watched the last stream you did. I mentioned myself as the guy who recited Pi with me, myself, and Pi, so yeah. I also commented if you still had two Lingans, but I only see one Lingan in your videos now, so sad face. If you have any puzzles you don't want anymore, make sure you take them to the next California competition for me to buy off of you. If you want to, that is, anyways. The picture I sent. You was three of my Pokemon for my Platinum, Nuzlocke, don't know what that is. And yes, those are the actual names and behaviors. Haha, -ha, Shang Xiao is sneaky after all. Also, there is a goldfish somewhere in there. Try and guess where it is. With this letter, I give you the Spanish, French, German, Russian, Greek, Korean, Japanese, Mandarin, Hebrew, Arabic, Wing, uh, Wingding, translated versions of this letter. Bonus points for trying to read each one. Live long and prosper. Christian, aka Tense on Fire. P.S. Alex Devani is a nub. So first, I want to say thank you so much for this. Thank you so much for this. Also, I, I will definitely look for the goldfish in about a few seconds. I'm trying to actually look for it right now, but I can't find it. But uh, Alex Devani has actually made a channel, and they are, and he is actually making videos now. So it's youtube.com slash alexdevanythenub. Pretty sure that's it. Uh, if that's not it, or whether it is it or not, I'll have an annotation here, and I'll also have an annotation in the description, or a link in the description. So... Uh, I, I, I'm not reading all these languages, I'm sorry, but here, I'll show all of them. There's the Spanish, there's the French, there's the German, I actually know a little bit of German. I uh, don't know these ones. I kind of just says Alex Devani and then all, all that. Devani, blah 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 blah. Devani. Devani. There's no Devani there, and Devani spelt incorrectly in Hebrew, Arabic, and I don't know what the last one was. But okay, let's go ahead and look for the goldfish in here. Oh, found it. Okay, the goldfish is right there. That's a very appropriate place to put it. Now you're making me focus right there. There's the goldfish. So that's what I like to see. Guys, I want you guys to draw something awesome. I'm not going to tell you what crazy thing to draw this time.
but I still have one more package. But hide a goldfish somewhere so that I can try and find it. So thank you so much for this drawing. Now on to the next package. And this package consists of quite a few puzzles, so thank you so much for that. Uh, that was a horrible way to open it. Where is the opening anyways? Pretty sure this is it. Yes, okay. So, let's see. This also comes from CubeZZ. So he ordered it from CubeZZ to my P.O. box, so there's no letter in it. But I just remembered he did write me a letter, so I will actually go open that up on my phone right before I have to look in here. And I will be right back. Alright, so on my computer I have the letter opened up. It says, Hey the Cube Dude, this is Cubenut, and I'm a huge fan of your videos. To show my love of your videos, I have sent you a few cubes. Your channel was the one was the one to inspire me to create videos, and I'm very happy I almost have 500 subscribers. If you're not yet subscribed to my channel, Cubenut, be sure to go and subscribe. Thanks, Cubenut. Okay, so thank you so much for that. Let's get into the puzzles. So on the outside, it did say like metal ball set, so I know what one of these things is. And I think I already have it, but it's awesome still. Here we have all of these that are kind of taped together, and then that. So here we have we have this. Oh my god, this is actually the puzzle I really wanted. It's like the YJ two x two cat thing. And then here, what do we have here? I believe this is going to be a Smaz Dino Cylinder. Hopefully it's white and not black because I recently unboxed a black. And it is black. Awesome. Still, that's pretty cool. So now I have two of these. Here we have what I believe to be the Shang Shao. Oh, not Shang Shao. Lan Lan. Oh, my bad. The Dian Shang Pai. So I'm just going to go ahead and scramble that up. Might actually be Mosey. I don't even know if Mosey does one, but that's how that one turns. This, if you guys want to see more about that, check out my one of my most recent unboxings. Here we have, what is this? This right here is a mini 3x3, a mini Maru 3x3, I think. What is this? Yeah, Maru, okay. This is really cool. This is, compared to a... Uh, what is this? This is a Dianma. That's the size of that. It turns pretty good for a small speed cube. A small 3x3. Then here we have the Cyclone Boys 4x4, which I also recently unboxed. So if you guys want more on that, check out one of my most recent unboxings. It's kind of stiff, but it is pretty good, I guess. Metal layers could be better. So there's those four puzzles so far. Then where's the sixth? I'm pretty sure there was a sixth that I may have thrown on the floor somewhere. Anyways, let's get on to this. This I'm really excited for. I hate those big boxes. I always destroy them. Okay, so this is a 2x2. Two two. You probably already see how it turns. I like how it's a 2x2. Two two. So this is just a little cute toy. It's going to be something I'll solve a few times. But anyways, here, yes, we do have this. We have this little ball set. Alright, so I was able to open this up. And here are the balls. You can make some cool stuff with this. I do have a bigger version, which I will pull out right now. This is the way I thought it was. These are bucky balls. I feel like I'll lose these, but I might do something cool with them. I won't have a video on, on them because it's not a twisty puzzle. But also I have Bucky Cubes, which are the same things, but little magnetic cubes. So I also just looked at the box in between that cut and I realized that it was just five puzzles and then these. So here is the YJ 2x2 cap thing, dino cylinder, a pie or a cheese block, not exactly sure of the correct name, a mini Mario 3x3, and the Cyclone Boys 4x4. Alright, so I'd like to give a shout out to all the people who sent me something, a big shout out to Christian Martin, to AIOLAS Cubing, 
to Cubernaut and Carson Lefebvre. Thank you guys so much. And also, did I say Matt or was one of those Matt? All right, so I'd like to give a big shout out to everybody who sent me something. That includes Christian Martin, A I O L A S Cubing, Cubinot, Carson Lefebvre, and I'm pretty sure that's it. If I forgot your name, I'm sorry. But thank you guys so much for sending me all these puzzles. I really do appreciate it. And also this wonderful drawing and also the letters. I really appreciate it. So I don't have anything crazy for you guys to draw, so you guys can come up with anything, use your imagination, make it something appropriate. And so with anything you send me, please put your YouTube channel or your real name if you prefer that, and I'll give you a shout out. Just try your best to keep everything appropriate. Feel free to send letters as well as... Just try your best to keep everything appropriate. And you can just feel free to send letters too. You don't really have to do a drawing, but drawings would be awesome. This series all depends on how much stuff you all send me and how often. If nobody sends me anything, there won't be a series. I'm hoping this series goes on for a long time with the help of all of you. My PO Box address can be found in the description. Please put the name as Matthew Dickman and not Cube Dude. Feel free to let me know if you will be sending me something. If you have any questions, feedback, or suggestions on how to improve my videos, please let me know in the comments below. Please leave a like and read the description for the Letter War winners. This video's letters are CLM. Read the description if you are confused about what these letters are for. Discounts and coupons can be found in the description as well. I hope you all enjoyed, and thanks for watching. Frankly, my dear, I don't give a damn.